It's been estimated that between 90 and 100,000 young people in the Southland are gang members. While the situation at times seems hopeless, there are people working hard to stop the violence. Mark Brown is here with the last of a series of reports on people who are getting out alive, Mark. That's right, Susan and Paul. You know, people who work with at-risk youngsters say the best way to get them to say no to gangs is to give them something to say yes to. Today, we'll meet a man who's chipping away at the gang problem in his community by offering an alternative he calls the right way. Alex Poe believes just enough isn't good enough. I joined a gang when I was 11 years old. From then, it was like, hey, mom couldn't tell me anything, you know. I was controlled by my friends, you know, like most of these kids out here, you know. It's like the blind leading the blind, in a sense. The same streets where he came of age now tempt a new generation of youngsters. Alex Poe is trying to break the cycle of failure with a homegrown program called The Right Way. His home is his headquarters. His message to the youngsters who come here is there is an alternative to gang membership. At a time when so many have given up on the gang-ravaged youth of South Central L.A., Alex Poe has committed his home and his energy to saving young people from gangs. How does he do it? He teaches kids to believe in themselves. Okay, I'm basically the founder of Right Way Youth Activities, which it's a, it's a program that we founded uh, in 1986. Um, it's a program designed to teach kids how to say no to drugs, crime, teenage pregnancy, and poor performance in school in a language that they can understand and relate to. 